Hi everybody, it's Matt from USG. Uh, this is Knowledge Hub and continuing on with our fittings. This time we're going to look at press fit and we're going to press fit some 15mm pipe work. So with the press fit, the first thing that we need is obviously the press fit tool. Uh, many different types. Uh, this one's a Gerberit one and we've got the press fit tool and the 15mm clamps. So the first thing I'm going to do with this is I'm just going to attach the jaws onto the press fit tool and lock them in place. So I'm happy the jaws are on the tool, it's nice and secure and it's all in place. So what we now need to do then is again measure, cut and clean the pipe, uh, which we've already done in this case, and then select the correct fitting. Now with press fit there's two different types of fittings. We have ones for water and ones for gas, and these are distinguishable by the different colour O-rings inside. So if we look at the first one here, and we look inside, and you look in there, this has got a black O-ring with inside, and this black O-ring is on both sides. Now this is for water, okay? This must not be used on gas at all. If we're going to use on gas, then we pick up and check inside, but this time you'll see that we've got a yellow O-ring or a yellow rubber O-ring inside. So these are the ones that we use on gas. Now again, to attach this, once I've cleaned the pipe work, made sure there's no burrs or anything, I'm just gonna push the fit in onto the pipe work, making sure that it's fully in and it's come to a stop. So again, that's the pipe work joined. So now what we need to do then is using the press fit tool, we're going to open up the jaws, attach the fitting into the jaws and then operate the tool and this will clamp down on the pipe work. Now this is similar in action to a compression fitting. So let's have a look at that. So we get the tool, we open it up, place the pipe work into the correct part and then just close the jaw. From here, all I'm going to do, holding the pipe stable and secure, I'm going to operate the tool. What this will do is clamp down on it until it's fully done and then it will release like this. So once it's done, I can release the jaw, release the fitting, turn it round, put the fitting back into the jaw again and just operate it exactly the same as I've just done. Again, once it's finished, I take the pipe, I'm just going to make sure it is securely fitted. The fittings looks as though it's been pressed. Now with press fittings on all completed joints, we're just going to mark them up with a black X using a marker. So I'm just going to get my marker, I'm just going to apply it over onto the joint. And this will be telling me when I've got a series of joints or a big stretch of pipe work what needs completing that these are actually completed joints and that guys is uh, matt from usg with knowledge hub and press fitting a 15 mil pipe with a 15 mil fitting thank you if you're enjoying this video please like and subscribe to the channel